Hello guys, so welcome back to a brand new video here today upon my channel guys. Today my friends, I've got something awesome that I want to be reacting to. And this is a Tomb Raider fan film. And I was reached out to by Kate Sykes. And I want you to all do me a favor right now. I want you to check out the channel. It says here, uh, 12 years after her mother's disappearance, a young woman inherits the family estate upon turning 18. And soon discovers a hidden secret that will change everything, including her. This is a short film written, directed, and produced by Kate Sykes, inspired by the Tomb Raider franchise to help change perspectives of those with disabilities are portrayed uh, portrayed on the screen. Okay, so we're going to be checking this one out, boys. Okay, we're going to be checking this out. The following is a no-budget, no-fan film for entertainment purposes only. Laura Croft and Tomb Raider are properties of Square Enix Ltd. Okay. The premise of this film is only for creative impression, inspired by one of the largest standing stories of all time. Ready? So that's Kate. So literally this person reached out to me like on one of my Tomb Raider fan made games and said would I, would I check out a fan made trailer? And I was like, yeah, sure, I'll check it out. And here we are today, guys. Terry Sykes. Ben Park. Stephen Quinn. Stephen Quinn. I believe these belong to you. You know, I remember the day your mother was born. Her cries echoed through these halls. She'd be very proud of the woman you have become. If you need anything, I won't be far away. Thanks to you. It was a wonderful gesture for leaving me that cottage. Hmm. Still, you didn't have to do. Oh. <laughs> I'll see you soon. This is really well edited and put together. Loving the music as well in the background. Proper fits the atmosphere. Ooh. Let's make sure, yeah, quality is all good. So it's an ATP. Just making sure what the quality was. If it needed to be upped a bit more or anything. Dearest Athena, by the time you find this letter, I'll be gone and the estate will belong to you. You'll make a fine lady of that, I'm sure. The book in front of you is possibly the greatest historical find in centuries. It is the diary of Judas Iscariot, one of the twelve disciples of Jesus Christ. It is proof that Jesus did indeed live over 2,000 years ago and that he is eventually betrayed. Of course, it could also cause great unrest if this was ever known to the public. That is why I kept it hidden, but my efforts failed. People came for it, ruthless men who will stop at nothing to get it. So I will face them, and I won't see you again, though it tears me apart. I must let the world believe I'm dead so that you will be safe. I hope you can forgive me. I only ask you do not look for me. I can take care of myself. One day, more may come for the diary. If that day comes, you must protect it, whatever it takes. He's got a weapon, guys. I'm sorry. I must put this burden on your shoulders, but you are strong, Lily. You have been from the moment you were born, which is the reason you were given that name. My darling girl, my life changed the day you came into it because whatever happens, 
I want you to remember. This world holds no greater treasure than you. With you all. This is really good. Mum. I wouldn't want to mess with Kate when it comes to, like, just, like, getting on the wrong side, you know what I mean? Especially if she knows how to use a weapon. <laughs> but this is really good. This is really, really, really well put together. So I just want to say thank you as well, Kate. If you're watching this video, thank you for reaching out to me to check this out because this is amazing. him for 29 days now and I freely admit that in the beginning I was skeptical many of us were but I cannot deny what my own eyes have seen he is much more than a gifted healer upon his touch the darkness around those he tends to is shed as if there is a new life we are truly witnessing the presence of God himself. I do not know how much longer I can live this way. I am nothing more than a shadow beneath his greatness and I grow tired of it. The Romans hung us. And I know what he is worth. I shall be a shadow no longer. I'm loving the visuals to it and everything. It's like... It's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. Oh. Who's this person? Proper nice home as well, like with how big it is. Does this person actually own this place, or would they, like hide it out just to I mean, make this fan-made project? All the rooms, it's there somewhere. What about the girl? She's armless. <clears throat> but should there be any complications, use whatever means necessary. Understood. She's harmless, but she's got weapons, man, and she knows how to use them. So it seems like this guy is potentially a bad guy. Let's be careful, Kate. Uh -oh. Where is it? <laughs> side. So we're searching for the spook. Really good acting as well. It's not a, it's not like perfect, but it's really good for a fan made project. Like on point. <laughs> Told you, man. Don't mess with Kate. She knows how to use pistols. Archaeological 
specialist, an archaeologist, and author Laura Croft. Missing. Searched up on Google. Ancient city in Western Mexico. Nice. Really nice place as well. This is why you don't mess with her, you know what I mean? She's got two weapons. She can dual win pistols like Lara Croft. But that is Athena, my friends. That is Athena. So I just want to say, this is really, really, really well put together. It is really, really, really good. Heroes exist to inspire, to teach us to fight for what we believe is right. For some of us, they reflect who we really feel. And we are on the inside. They don't look like us on the outside. That should change. There should be more heroes for everyone, no matter who you are. Starting now, let's help change perspectives, perceptions of how those with disabilities are portrayed on screen. If one disabled person is inspired by this film, every word is succeeded. Written, directed, and edited by Kate Sides. Well done. Okay, I'm really proud of you for this. Athena Croft, Kate Sykes, Laura Croft's Katie Davis Speak, Winston, the head of the household, Terry Sykes, Judas, Jason Rhodes, Operative Ben Park, Voice on the Phone, Ste Ste um, Stephen Quinn, and David Sykes as the driver. Camera, Sam Sykes, Kate Sykes, David Sykes, Steve Stark, yeah, speak, sorry. Okay, so pretty much a lot of this is done by Kate, and I'm assuming there are other people who are friends or family, I'm assuming so. Um, but other than that though, this is this has been brilliant. So I just want to say thank you, Kate, for reaching out to me and commenting on obviously on my video that I made on a Tomb Raider fan made game. Asking me to check this out. Do you know what I'm going to do right now to, sh to show my support? I'm going to subscribe to your channel and Aceta's. I'm going to give this video a big fat thumbs up. You know what I mean? So I want you guys to do the same. I'm going to put a link to Kate's channel, guys, in the description. Click the link, go to her channel, check out this video, check out all the content that she's done on her channel. Make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon and let them know that Aaron Cooper has sent you their way. Show your support, okay? Because. I agree with everything that's been stated in this video, and for a, t for a Tomb Raider fan film, I think this is just absolutely brilliant. So, well done, Kate. Well done for all the people that starred in this. You've done an absolutely great job. Proud of you all, and I hope to see more great content from you all in the future. So, if you enjoyed the video, guys, make sure you give it a big fat thumbs up, and subscribe if you're new. would really, really appreciate it. And make sure you hit the post notification icon, the little bell icon, so it notify you when I upload any new content in the nearby future. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Stay safe, stay awesome, and I'll see you again in my next video.